There are 196 million licensed drivers in the United States. However, despite this, the highways across the world have seen very little improvements since made in the early mid-1900s. As the amount of drivers increases, the need for a more efficient, safe, and comfortable driver experience will need to arise. We propose the highway of the future to be designed around safety, energy, and overall driver experience. First, a host of small wind turbines will be placed alongside of the roadway. Turbines will collect mechanical energy from the car draft coming off the roadway. Also, in the cause of the roadway having low user volume, the turbines will freely rotate to take advantage of natural wind flowing over the roadway. The turbine network will help to power the streetlights along the roadway. LED streetlights will illuminate the roadway and make for a safer driving at night. To conserve energy, the lights will be networked with an array of infrared sensors that will turn on the lights ahead of time as needed and turn them off after cars pass by. Also, aiding in improving the safety and energy efficiency of the road will be the use of advanced paints. Phosphorescence paints will be used to make the lines on the roadway more visible. Glowing road markers will cut down the need for lighting and allow an easier differentiation of lanes during night driving. Thermochromic paints will be applied to the roadway to provide a visual aid to drivers in case of icy conditions. To promote the use of electric cars, an induction charging unit will be planted under the rightmost lane. Electric cars will be able to refill their batteries at a slower speed, allowing a free electricity type effect to occur. As more and more non-renewable resources become scarce, the cost of them begin to rise, therefore making long-range electric transportation a more and more frequently used thing for drivers wanting to pay less money on transportation. The future will only see the introduction of more drivers to the road, and approved roadways should be there to meet them.